The bog turtle is imperiled mainly because it requires very specific habitat. That habitat is freshwater wetlands that is open, so it allows the bog turtles to get abundant sunlight to be able to bask and nest. Um, these wetlands are also uh, groundwater fed. Since bog turtles require uh, these groundwater seeps as their habitat, um, there's a direct connection between uh, bog turtle habitat and the Kirkwood Cohansey Aquifer. These seeps and springs that are, are the beginning of the Upper Salem River um, are incredibly important because this is where you know, all of the water really comes from in the Salem River. Um, and then these wetlands that these seeps are, are helping to form then help, uh, help filter out that water and help retain some of that water, help the water infiltrate into the ground um, to sort of form that relationship between the aquifer and the streams and the rivers. The Harris family, they operate uh, the Cowtown Rodeo, um, and they're a large-scale livestock operation. This property um, is great pasture land, but also happens to have uh, bog turtle habitat on site. And so what they do is, is critically important to protecting uh, the Salem River and the habitat that's surrounding that. When you tell someone that you are from the Cowtown Rodeo and <laughs> you're in New Jersey. They look at you like you have three heads. Um, there's, they said there's no way there's a rodeo in New Jersey and there's no way that New Jersey has that amount of good, clean ground. The, the preservation and conserving of this land was incidental to our day-to-day -day operations anyway. Uh, so, you know, that kind of all worked in our direction and the uh, subsequent land that we've preserved was used to buy more land, which adds to the habitat that for these rare and endangered species of flora and fauna. If you have bog turtle habitat, that means that, that you have a healthy functioning wetland. Uh, bog turtles need clean water, and so if they're persisting, that means that uh, we have clean fresh water available for drinking, available for irrigation, available for recreation. And so having bog turtle uh, habitat uh, in your community means that your wetlands are, are working the way that they should be working. They're retaining flood water. They're helping to recharge the aquifer. They're helping to filter out water. Uh, they're doing all of the things that, that we need to, to have clean and fresh and abundant drinking water.